Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. So in this video, I'm going to focus on this uh, SQL question called all people report to the given manager. So let's first read through this problem. So there is one table, uh, the employee table. So essentially it has three columns, the employee ID, uh, the corresponding employee name, and the corresponding manager ID. So the question is to ask us to write a SQL query to find employee ID of all the employees that they directly or indirectly report their work to the head of the company. So the indirect relationship between managers will not exceed three managers as the company is very small. So it wants us to return the result table in any other without duplications. So for example, let's see, for this table, we have the boss with manager ID as one. And we have Alice with employee ID as three and uh, the manager uh, ID is three as well. For Bob, the employee ID is two and they reports to the boss with employee ID as one, so so on and so forth. And finally, uh, we are going to return to 77, four and seven, who directly or indirectly report to the boss. Uh, with employee ID as one, so um, so that is uh, so when I say the employee ID as one is a boss, that is because it is this line. So it says that the height of the company is an employee with employee ID as one, and it allows us to uh, get indirect or direct report to the to the head of the company. So. Uh, the SQL query is pretty simple. So first of all, we just uh, get all the direct reports to the head, but we don't really need want to re, uh, include the employee ID as one because employee ID as one is the head of the company. And then we get the second layer report, which reports to the direct report of uh, head, the head. And also uh, we are going to have this like the third layer of the report which is similarly uh, as the second layer report, how we get the second layer report. So essentially something like uh, we want to get all the employee IDs with the manager ID in the second layer report. And finally, we are going to merge all of the three views together uh, by union them together and then report the result together. So that's pretty much it about uh, the SQL query. So if you have any question regarding the solution or regarding whatever, feel free to leave some comments below. If you like this video, please help subscribe to this channel. I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.